Yo, what is going on guys? Drake here with Unlock Boots YouTube channel, and in today's video we have a tutorial for you guys for how to remove the FRP Google Lock on your Samsung Galaxy S9. So if you got a Samsung Galaxy S9 and it happens to be locked to a different Google account and you don't know the password or you forgot it or anything like that, all you have to do is follow along with these steps and we will be able to remove that lock for you. So the first thing we're going to do, let's say right here I have a uh, brand new factory reset Samsung Galaxy S9. I'm going to connect to Wi-Fi real fast. And all right guys, this is what the FRP lock screen will look like if you have a Google account that is tied down to the device and you cannot reset it or access it. If you do not know what it is, then no worries, we are here to help. And all right guys, the first step will be to go to store.unlockboot.com. The link will be down in the description below to do so. And now you're just going to want to click unlock now and then scroll all the way down to the very bottom and then you will find frp unlock which is the one that we're looking for here as we can see it says verify your accounts frp unlock service by usb google account removal service in one to 24 hours so all you're going to want to do is go ahead and fill out the service that you are looking for for which model that you have as well as your imei number now, if you can't find this IMEI number, it is okay because sometimes the IMEI number is inside of the software and you're not able to access it, that's totally fine. However, if you do know your IMEI, go ahead and type that in. Also, typically, if you do need to find the IMEI somewhere on the hardware, it is either on the box of the phone or sometimes it is engraved on the back plate of the phone. So one of those ways to find the IMEI. After you fill out the IMEI information, go ahead and click unlock now and complete checkout. And after completing checkout, you will then receive an email from Unlock Boot support team letting you know that the service is ready to go ahead and take place. So what you need to have is a good connection for internet, a PC with Windows 10, 8, or 7, and a USB Type-C cable for your Samsung Galaxy S9. And after you have all of those things and you are ready to get started, the first thing that you're going to want to do is download TeamViewer. The link will be down in the description below, as well as the link to everything that will be mentioned in this video. But you just want to go ahead and download the programs that it says to. Make sure that you install those as our Unlock Boot service team will connect remotely and then we will then complete the unlock for you. But once you have everything set up on the PC and phone, our technicians will go ahead and connect and remove the lock. So this might take um, maybe up to 30 minutes. It's a very fast process, but after it's done, your phone will reset and then you will be good to go free of the Google Unlock. And all right guys, after the phone resets, then you will go ahead and once you go to the Google sign in page, you can see that it no longer asks you to sign in with the Google account that was locked to the phone, but now you can go ahead and just skip it. Or if you already have a different account, you can let that in. We're just going to click skip and we are done here. We don't have to do anything here. We don't have to do anything here. And we successfully got past the Google unlock on your Samsung Galaxy S9. Again, this was a very simple tutorial and let us know if we did help out as we were able to help you guys uh, get past this lock. Again, the links to everything will be down in the description below. So that's going to do it. Signing off, this is Drake with Unlock Boot. We'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.